Despite the launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, which is the most powerful space telescope, the Hubble Space Telescope hasn't stopped being relevant yet. It has been doing an outstanding job and has sent images of several stunning space phenomena to the Earth recently, which are of great importance for the research and understanding of the universe. In this video, we'll look at some of the recent spectacular images taken by the Hubble Space Telescope. Make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video to witness these beautiful space phenomena. Before we begin, welcome to Discover Space. If you want to be a part of our space journey, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell next to it to be the first to know whenever we upload a new video. Number 15, NGC 976. This image shows the lazily winding spiral arms of the spectacular galaxy NGC 976. The spiral galaxy lies around 150 million light years from the Milky Way in the constellation Aries. Despite its tranquil appearance, NGC 976 has played host to one of the most violent astronomical phenomena known as supernova explosion. These disastrously violent events take place at the end of the lives of massive stars and can outshine entire galaxies for a short period. Number 14, NGC 3318. This image shows the lazily draped spiral arms of the galaxy NGC 3318. This spiral galaxy lies in the constellation Vela and is roughly 115 million light years away from Earth. Vela was originally part of a far larger constellation known as Argo Navis after the fabled ship Argo from Greek mythology. This unwieldy constellation proved to be impractically large. Argo Navis was split into three separate parts called Carina, Pupis, and Vela. The outer edges of NGC 3318 almost resemble a ship's sails billowing in a gentle breeze. Number 13, NGC 7764A. This image shows a group of three galaxies, known collectively as NGC 7764A. The two galaxies in the upper right of the image appear to be interacting with one another. The long trails of stars and gas extending from them both look like they have both just been struck at great speed, thrown into disarray by the bowling ball shaped galaxy at the lower left of the image. However, interactions between galaxies happen over very long periods and galaxies rarely collide head-on with one another. Number 12, NGC 1705. This image shows the dwarf galaxy, NGC 1705. This tiny galaxy lies in the southern constellation Pictor and is approximately 17 million light years from Earth. NGC 1705 is a small, irregularly shaped and has recently undergone a spat of star formation known as a starburst. Despite these peculiarities, NGC 1705 and other dwarf irregular galaxies like it can provide valuable insights into the overall evolution of galaxies. These galaxies tend to contain few elements other than hydrogen or helium and are considered to be similar to the earliest galaxies that populate the universe. Number 11, ARP 282. This image shows the ARP 282, an interacting galaxy pair that is composed of the Seifert Galaxy NGC 169 at the bottom and the galaxy IC 1559 at the top. Interestingly, both of the galaxies have monumentally energetic cores, known as active galactic nuclei. If the full emission of two AGNs was visible in this image, then it would probably obscure the beautifully detailed tidal interactions occurring between the two galaxies. Number 10, IC 2431. The mass of dust and bright spirals of stars that you see in this image are the distinct galaxy merger IC 2431 which lies 681 million light years from Earth in the constellation Cancer. It appears to be a triple galaxy merger in process, as well as a tumultuous mixture of star formation and tidal distortions caused by gravitational interactions of this galactic trio. The center of this image is covered by a thick cloud of dust, though light from a background galaxy can be seen piercing through it. Number 9, ARP-298. This image shows the ARP-298, a stunning pair of interacting galaxies. ARP-298 comprises the two galaxies NGC 7469 and IC 5283. It lies roughly 200 million light years from Earth in the constellation Pegasus. The larger of the two galaxies here is the Baird spiral galaxy NGC 7469, and IC 5283 is its smaller companion. NGC 7469 is also host to an active supermassive black hole and a bright ring of star clusters. Number eight, twin galaxies. This image shows the twin galaxies NGC 4496A and NGC 
4496b that lie in the constellation Virgo. Despite appearing side by side in this image, they are at vastly different distances from both Earth and one another. NGC 4496a is 47 million light years from Earth, while NGC 4496b is 212 million light years away. The enormous distances between the two galaxies mean that the two cannot interact, and they only appear to overlap. Number 7. NGC 1097 This image shows the heart of NGC 1097, a bare spiral galaxy that lies about 48 million light years from Earth in the constellation Fornax. This picture reveals the complexity of the web of stars and dust at NGC 1097 center, with the long tendrils of dust picked out in a dark red hue. Number 6. NGC 4571 This image shows a stunning view of the spiral galaxy NGC 4571, which lies approximately 60 million light years from Earth in the constellation Coma Berenice. As majestic as spiral galaxies like NGC 4571 are, they are far from the largest structures known to astronomers. NGC 4571 is part of Virgo Cluster, which contains more than a thousand galaxies. This cluster, in turn, part of the larger Virgo supercluster, which also encompasses the local group, which contains our own galaxy, the Milky Way. Number 5. NGC 7172 In this image, tendrils of dark dust can be seen treading across the heart of the spiral galaxy NGC 7172. The galaxy lies approximately 110 million light years from the Earth in the constellation Pisces Austrinus. The lane of dust treading its way across NGC 7172, which is viewed side-on in this image, is obscuring the luminous heart of the galaxy, making NGC 7172 appear to be nothing more than a normal edge-on spiral galaxy. NGC 7172 is a cipher galaxy, a type of galaxy with an intensely luminous active galactic nucleus powered by matter accreting onto a supermassive black hole. Number 4. NGC 5921 this image highlights the lazily winding spiral arms of the galaxy NGC 5921. This galaxy lies approximately 80 million light years from Earth, and much like our own galaxy, the Milky Way, contains a prominent bar. Roughly half of all spiral galaxies are thought to contain bars, and these bars affect their parent galaxies by fueling star formation and affecting the motion of stars and interstellar gas. Approximately, giving NGC 5921 serpentine spiral arms, this galaxy resides in the constellation Serpens in the northern celestial hemisphere. Number 3. M91 This image shows the spiral galaxy M91. M91 lies approximately 55 million light years from Earth in the constellation Coma Berenice, and as can be seen in this image, it is a bared spiral galaxy. While M91's prominent bar makes for a spectacular galactic portrait, it also hides an astronomical monstrosity. Like our own galaxy, M91 contains a supermassive black hole at its center. It has been found that this central black hole weighs somewhere between 9.6 and 38 million times as much as the Sun. Number 2. NGC 6558 This image shows the glittering gatherings of stars, which is the global cluster NGC 6558. NGC 6558 is closer to the center of the Milky Way than Earth is and lies about 23,000 light years away in the constellation Sagittarius. Global clusters like NGC 6558 are tightly bound collections of tens of thousands to millions of stars, and they can be found in a wide range of galaxies. As this image shows, the stars in global clusters can be densely packed. This image is thronged with stars in a rich variety of hues. Number 1. Little One this image shows the muted red tones of the global cluster Lilla 1, which are partially obscured by a dense scattering of piercingly blue stars. Lilla 1 is only 30,000 light years away from Earth, relatively neighborly in astronomical terms, but it lies within the Milky Way's bulge, the dense and dusty region of our galaxy's center. Because of that, Lilla 1 is highly obscured from view by interstellar dust, which scatters visible light particularly blue light, very effectively. Lilla 1 is a particularly interesting global cluster because unlike most of its kind, it contains a mix of very young and very old stars. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to never miss another video. Also, let us know the image you're most amazed by in the comments section below. Until next time.